Man, I am sick of sitting on the floor out here. So I'm gonna take this single sheet of plywood and turn it into this awesome outdoor dining table and I'd love to show you how I did it on this episode of Field Treasure Designs. All right, let's get started. So I'll have the plans for this one sheet plywood table in the show notes below and on my website. So check those out. So basically right now I'm just using my track saw and I'm making all of my cuts. After that, I cut the apron parts and the table legs to length on my miter saw. Meanwhile, my wife is spray painting these awesome Windsor back chairs that we found at a thrift store for super cheap. Back in the shop, I needed to cut the taper for each of my table legs to give it kind of a modern, contemporary look. And so I laid my track saw guide rail down and made the cuts. And then once I was done, I used my first cut as a template to trace the line on the other three legs. Then I repeated the process for the other four inside legs. Next, I drilled pocket holes into the two inside aprons that will be used under the table. Then, you guessed it, using wood glue and pocket hole screws, I assembled it. After the rectangle was done, I laid it out so it was even on my table, and then I grabbed my one inch L brackets and spaced them around. You could obviously use pocket holes for this as well. I just didn't want to risk any of my screws popping through the top of the table. I felt like the L brackets would work just fine. One thing to note, I did put a longer drive bit into my drill to make it a little bit easier to screw those fasteners in. Okay, next up is attaching the outside leg. So I drilled pilot holes into the base of all of them. I used three on each, then I drove them in with screws. Next, I took my four inside legs and I drilled one pocket hole in the middle of each one so it could attach to the outside leg. Then I just repeated the process. I started with attaching the inside leg to the apron at the bottom and then I attached each leg to the outside leg using a pocket hole fastener. You might also notice that I'm using a clamp at the top of each leg to hold it together. Okay, the last fastener is the L brackets on the bottom of each leg. I just wanted to make sure those legs stayed together and I didn't want to use pocket holes down there. So I thought this was the best choice and I think it works fine. Then I routed around all the edges while the table was upside down. I actually am using this Ryobi cordless router for the first time and you can check out my review video on that tool coming up soon. Then I flipped the table over, carried it outside, and routed around the top as well. I wanted those edges to be nice and smooth. Then the fun part, sanding. So I sanded it out. I spared you all the extra details of all the sanding and the staining. And now here it is. My outdoor dining table made from a single sheet of three quarter inch plywood. Hey, don't forget, you can download the plans from the show notes below. Hey, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you on the next video. Thanks.